Hey guys, Wesley here. Coming to you from Chickamauga Lake. Thought I'd make a video this morning on how to adjust your overlays on your HDS units. I have people ask me all the time, hey man, how do I get the time on here? How do I get you know my speed on here? So I'm gonna figured I'd make a little short video and show you. Uh, we start by on the HDS units, your, even your Gen 2 Touch and your Gen 3 all do this. But once you've updated your Gen 2s, you can press the power button one time and all your controls will come up. So you can, right here, it's real easy to do on this new, on this new update. So edit overlays. Okay. Menu. We're going to add. So I'm just going to show you some things that personally I run. This is a real common screen. Split map, 2D sonar, down imaging. That's a that's a real common ledge screen for me when I'm out graphing fish deep. This is, these are probably my most used screen. So I like the the speed. It's not something you have to have, but I I like it. Um, sonar. We're going to add depth. Depth. We're going to add water temp. And I typically like to include the time. We'll do the time. Okay, so as you can see now, they're all over here on this left side. So we'll move them. I typically put my time down in the bottom. Just because it's not something that I'm concerned with all the time. Some Another thing I do, I configure, I take the caption off of everything. You don't need it. it I mean, you, you're going to look at that and know that that's the time. So, and the next thing I do, I make it bigger. So you can hit your plus sign, your plus button, just like you're zooming in. And it will make it bigger. Okay, so I'm happy with the time there. Let's go with our depth. I typically run it in the upper left of the sonar screen. Okay, again, caption off, and I make it one size bigger. Okay, same thing with our water temperature. Put it over here. We know what that is. I'm going to take the caption off, just a little less clutter on the screen. I usually don't make it bigger. Again, that's not something you need all the time. And then finally our speed, I do make it bigger. And that's all you do. Now that you've got your overlay set up like you want it, you just save them. And there they are. They're permanent unless you change them. And then if you do want to change them, say you want to edit, you, 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 you want your sonar down here. Let's just say, for example, go back to edit overlay. You can go here, drag it down there, save. Pretty simple. 